there is another car don't go you see that's the thing i was talking about oh my god it is going super fast now it can't it can't because it was going so fast now it is deciding what i'm gonna do it is oh my goodness this is something new it is just rerouting us from a different road so it is not turning on the indicator but it came to this lane perfectly because it's so dark it is just trying so hard to make a left turn it can do it i guess yes yes hello everyone we're back and yes normally i don't make videos at night time but finally i got the software version 12.5.4 as you can see 12.5.4 in newark long island so we're gonna definitely test it out right now and we're gonna see how the car performs in newark so let's check it out guys also guys if you guys are new in this channel make sure you subscribe to this channel and also this video is sponsored by are you a tesla fsd beta tester stop scrolling the fsd beta bumper magnet is a must have this sleek durable magnet clearly signals that your tesla is in self-driving mode it's easy to apply easy to remove and the perfect accessories for embracing the future of autonomous driving don't miss out grab yours on amazon today so we are going as as you see that ad please order that and in my every video your name will be in this video so i already got few orders at the end of the video you'll definitely see their name and let me know in the comment if you purchase that so that i can include your name too and thank you personally thank you so much so we're gonna make a right turn here as you can see our car is creeping and it stopped here for our other cars in the left side as you can see right now we just make that right turn pretty good no confusion no problem and also in version 12.5.2.1 uh the car failed one time to stop in this stop sign we're definitely gonna look at that moment too if the car recognized that a stop sign and stop so let's find it out guys also don't forget to subscribe to this channel because in this channel we're gonna talk about full self-driving so let's check it out guys so we are going straight and also it's very very nice not to touch the steering wheel at all if you're looking at the straight all the time you know like you're cautious the car knows it it is seeing your face we need to change the lane now so it is driving a little bit on the left side it was touching the white line a little bit so i just want to mention that we need to change the lane now to follow the destination so the car is doing it it should also follow that car uh, not that car. We need to change another lane right now to follow the destination. So, so let's see how the car handles this one. So it is not turning on the indicator, but it came to this lane perfectly. And we have to wait because there is another car. Don't go. You see, that's the thing I was talking about. It, was, it cannot see that, unfortunately, for some reason. Uh, it couldn't see that other car is coming. I don't have an outside camera right now, but there is a car coming very close to that opposite side. We need to stop. Otherwise, it, we have to just go fast. You know, like, but the car was deciding to go, so I break. Uh, first drive, first intervention. Uh, probably the car could have made it or, like, probably do a hard braking just to give that car, uh, you know, a space. But not like the idea going very closely when there is a car coming from the opposite side i'm gonna change the destination right now because we are gonna go okay you're going very close you're going very very close and now we're gonna go to our second destination which is our home because i want to see how the car make a left turn in this narrow road at night time normally i never come in this road when it's very narrow and dark but we have to see how the car handles this situation. Oh my God, it is going super fast. Now it can't, it can't because it was going so fast. Now it is deciding what I'm gonna do. It is, oh my goodness, this is something new. It is just rerouting us from a different road. Pretty, pretty excellent. Like I know you passed that now, you don't have any space to make that left turn but now you just rerouting us to a different route oh my god the car is doing so many things because it's so dark it is just trying so hard to make a left turn it can do it i guess yes yes because it was so dark 
the car couldn't see the left side properly but is in this situation i would definitely suggest the car to come slow and then decide slowly but at the very first moment the car was going super fast and then decided like oh i have to now make a left turn and it's very tight but it did it perfectly without any hesitation it just had to think like what i'm gonna do can i make it i have to calculate that you know now we're gonna make a right turn this is not a always stop sign but the car decided to just move forward um not a big issue but if there is any other car you just need to creep a little bit i'm seeing at night time the car is having some hard time looking on the left side and right side because it's so dark and because of that the car is having some hard time to navigate i'm very sorry if you can't see that because it's very dark inside my car too and it will be uh a little challenging wow that was good like calculating that space and make that right turn very nice so as i was saying um you know like um i completely forget what i was saying but uh, the car is having some hard time because of the dark and i was saying that uh because of this darkness inside of my car probably you guys ha are having some hard time looking in this screen too because it will be like noisy and stuff like that now we stop for this stop sign and now we have to look on our left side right over here to margin this road and there is no other car so we can do it perfectly no problem but i'm very excited to watch this exact route on daytime because daytime will be different definitely because it will be more light and sun and glares, uh, shadows and stuff like that. I'll definitely try that tomorrow. And we're going to find out how FSD performs. Again, we are using version 12.5.4 in New York. So it's pretty, pretty good till now. Like I didn't have to touch the steering wheel once. There is just one disengagement. I'll count it a critical disengagement because there is a car coming and our car didn't even see that. So, you know, like something is still probably because of the night time, it couldn't recognize everything, but it's dangerous. If you are an autonomous car, you need to see everything either is day or night. So don't forget to order our FSD bumper magnet from Amazon today and comment below. What do you think about this performance, right guys? We're making a left turn pretty nice. Again, I had to tell you that these roads are very dark and we don't have any light on our left side and right side to look. So it's a little hard for the car to get into this kind of road, uh, not seeing completely, right? So we are here and thank you for watching guys. I wish you all the best. Hopefully you also got this version and thank you for watching. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. It is very close to that red car.